Hi guys, welcome to Broadway TV News. My name is Ope. And it's your boy SBB Shane Bad Bunny Bidin your new five hundred friend. Poka poka poka. Now over to the headlines on us up on Broadway TV News. For Prisky Blast MC Live before mentioning his name in his new skit. Fans blast Ricky the Banks over his motivational advice tweets. Kemi Oluloyo is definitely not here for David and his new song, Onwa Baby. Timaya flies to ATL to welcome his newborn baby as celebrates his birthday. Speaking of Bob Risky, Bob Risky just showed off his behind in new Instagram video. What? His behind? Yeah, right. Well, wow. <laughs> just listen to the news in full details. Now, Kemi Oluloyo has blasted David over his new song, Onwa Baby. According to Kemi Oluloyo, Onwa Baby is not original. Wow. And David stole the song from Akon's. Um, you know, song locked up. Kemi Olunlo, however, advised David Doe to be original next time. Speaking that she actually really loves his music, she listens to him, everybody loves him, and next time he should be original. But anyway, I don't think uh, Kemi Olunlo's opinion I ever I mean, counts because <laughs> David Doe is always dropping it back, back to back. back. So whether it is not original, whether it is original, people love David Doe and people will keep listening to David Doe. Davido, it's Kemi Omolulu Olunloyo at HNN Africa, August 13th, 2018 in Ibadan, Nigeria. I just listened to your song and reviewed it. Locked up. Oh no, it's not locked up. It's Nwa Baby. I don't like the song, Davido. It's not original. Um, you sample that song from Akon's Locked Up with Styles P. I don't like songs that are not original. And all I heard, I listened to it 35 times in the last hour. All I heard was, I got locked up. Da -da -da -da, why, baby? And then it's like, I got locked up. Da -da 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 -da, why, baby? It's really boring. Try better on the next projects. They love you. You're doing great. They'll stream you. They'll support you. Try better. You know, I'm a music journalist. I've been a judge in the Grammys and the Junos. Okay? Adichan in Africa, Kemi. Love you. See you too. All right. So, Nigerian musician and Maven record act, Ricardo Banks, took to, Insta took to Twitter to drop a little motivational tweet for his people, telling them to work hard and hustle. And, you know, one day God bless their hustle. And for some reason, some fans took it like it was bad because they felt someone helped him which was Don Jazzy, because a fan even quoted and said, Don Jazzy helps some more boy, and that was what was in his song then. And now, they just feel it is really wrong, and he should learn to help people. But if Don Jazzy actually helped him, why is he saying, why is he, why is he, why is he bringing quotes like that? I think all the celebrities just like to form motivation. I think so, man. But anyway, moving on to Bob Risky. Bob Risky has blasted MC Lively for mentioning his name in his new skit. Uh, you know, Instagram comedian MC Lively yeah. did a skit about Bob Brisky saying that Bob Brisky can never be a mentor to anybody. Bob Brisky, however, however, got the hold of the video and said, um, MC Lively should mind his business. It's no, it, Bob Brisky is actually nobody's business. You know, Bob Brisky actually really insulted MC Lively. And I don't know, what, what were you actually expecting from Bob Brisky other than insults? You know? Bob Brisky actually has nothing to offer than insults and, you know. Uh, I, I, I think you rephrased that. I think he has a lot more to offer though. So, like, uh, like meet and greets. You know, seven and a half days is everywhere, and Bobriski was from ICM to Aja, you know. So Bobriski has a lot more to offer, though. Actually, speaking of what to offer, Bobriski actually offered Dross a video of his behind oh, on God. Instagram. Oh, now, Bobriski oh. has a way of, you know, turning the internet, you know, into a frenzy. Every time Bobriski is no longer in the news, Bobriski just has a way of, you know, Boom. bringing himself. Back. And I like Bobriski's consistency. Yeah, you understand? Yeah. All the time, Bobriski just, you know, has a way of telling you or letting you know that he's around and you should respect him. Now, Bobriski just showed up his butt on Instagram while he was in doing some body wash and all sorts. I thought that guy was wearing bum bum though. <laughs> Apparently he's not. <laughs> because he just showed us in full glare. Yeah, yeah. Hey guys, it's Bob Brisky. <laughs> what I saw, she so badass. 
what the real stuff looks like. Now, you know the funny thing about Bobriski is that anytime Bobriski posts something, you know as much as people say they don't like Bobriski, they don't like Bobriski, Bobriski is always having views, likes, likes. You know. people are always reposting the video. Look, I love Bob Risky, actually. Bob. I love Bob Risky's consistency. Kudos to you. I love his resilience. You know, Bob Risky, even if he actually cares, Bob Risky is someone that looks like he doesn't actually care, even though he cares. But, you know, we love you, Bob Risky. We love you. Keep doing your thing. Timaya flies to ATL briefly. He said he had to rush to ATL to go and welcome his newborn baby as he's celebrating his birthday today. So, Demama Records owner and CEO, Timaya Igberi Papa number one of Biosa, ran to ATL, like, rush to ATL, to go and welcome his newborn. Please, me, I want to, can you rush to ATL? Me, I want to rush to ATL, but you just rushed to ATL to welcome his newborn baby. So congratulations to Dissimaya. For more information, please visit our website at www.broadwaytv.tv. And on Instagram, it's Broadway TV. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel below. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We love you. Mwah.